Good afternoon, everyone. It was the best of times. It was the worst of times. Fascinating times, unprecedented times, uh, historic times, but not the end of times. And I'm here with uh, CEO of Edge Theory and Soundboard, Joe Stratinger. My name is Jeff Olson. I've been a top earner in direct sales and uh, for 20 some years as an independent business owner working out of my house uh, using technology uh, and in the world of social media and the world of conversations. Uh, we are all wondering what kind of conversations to have right now, how to connect right now, how to be effective, but, but have wisdom and have grace and be thoughtful. And so Joe's got some interesting thoughts on that. And I thought I'd bring him on here and hear his yeah. wisdom. Joe, thanks yeah. for joining. I mean, the one thing I think about, you know, Jeff, we've talked a lot about this and I, I really, as I watch, um, we're in an interesting crisis that we've never seen before. Um, uh, we can all have our opinions and the political opinions and see what see what's going to happen and we all have our different thoughts but at the end of the day I think this is you know I look at any crisis as an opportunity um, and um, and we can come out better for it we're going to get through this as we've talked about but to me I continue to see people especially in the network marketing and the direct sales space really heavily on Facebook Facebook's powerful I love Facebook it's a great way to nurture your your warm market and so forth prospects. But I would take the time, and I think um, even when you're out there just talking about your business, you know, Facebook is both a, a personal platform and a business platform, right? It's both. And I think right now we're treading on some very sensitive, you know, sensitivity. You look, just look at people's uh, timelines. People are getting, you know, crucified for talking about their spring break trip. So think about that. You know, this is not the time that even if you're not pitching, I think it's a time to show a little restraint, maybe even be in businessy at all on Facebook for a couple of weeks. But what that means is go to LinkedIn. I mean, LinkedIn to me, it doesn't mean just, just take a little time away from Facebook for a second. LinkedIn is a place to talk about your business. LinkedIn is a place where you, it's for professionals. It's not a platform where you're going to find people talking about their kids in spring break and, and what they're doing. It is a professional platform. So, you know, what, what I think, Jeff, is that we just, I think this is an ideal time not only to go learn it, um, while we're uh, probably have more time, learn it, but use it. And I think you have, there's much more grace, you know, in talking about a business on LinkedIn than there is on Facebook right now. Well, even, even just asking questions about business, you know, what's, what's working, what's not, best practices, you know, I, I think the forum of LinkedIn you know, in, in, in sales, you talk about, you know, qualifying the customer, qualifying the conversation. I mean, here you have a whole platform where the conversation is already qualified. <laughs> I mean, yeah. it is there for business resumes. It is there for business ideas. It is there for business connections. And so I think it's appropriate. Um, as I said in our previous, some of our previous chats, I'm, I'm more focused than ever on LinkedIn here in 220. Uh, and this was three, four months ago, but now, even now, I think it's even more so. So uh, yeah. Yeah. you guys got some great tools. You got some new technology. I think, you know, the ability to use artificial intelligence and, and go into LinkedIn or even go into Facebook and use your technology to kind of screen scrape and get their interests and, and become relevant uh, and timely with, with uh, aligning with conversations that the person you want to connect with is interested in. Um, yeah. Tell folks how they can kind well, of yeah, we, we, go you know, quick and test drive what you're doing. Yeah, and I'll just tell you, you know, we, we serve almost every country, you know, almost every, you know, lots of network marketing companies across multiple countries and multiple languages. And we're seeing that the usage is picking up, of course. But that's why we, we sort of have an insight into, into what people don't have. Network marketers are using our content heavily and both Facebook and LinkedIn, but I think LinkedIn, you know, is a place you know, really, really go, go take advantage of. Um, it's safer. Um, you're not going to come out with a black eye as you might with Facebook right now. You're, you might be, you might really hurt your reputation long time on long term on Facebook if you don't uh, take some, you know, take a more calmer approach right now. But yeah, just, um, you know, we have soundboard.social where people can buy the product, but I would just encourage people just go to the Chrome web store, just go to the Chrome store, in your browser, type in soundboard, um, download the, the Chrome extension, and just go to LinkedIn. That's all you gotta do, and you'll see how Yeah, and I think just to kind of in closing, I think there may be some, some legislation coming down the pike from Congress that really impacts uh, 
people who have a home-based business. So stay tuned. More from Jeff and Joe coming up on, on that and how to benefit and take advantage of that. Thanks, Jeff. Till next time. Thanks, Joe.